is above the I know. I don't think okay. <laughs> Hi everybody, it's Leonie Powers here at Modern Herbal. I don't know if you can tell that I'm in here, but um, today is an exciting day. I almost couldn't sleep last night because it is honey harvest day and we are harvesting some of the honey from our own beehives. Um, I just wanted to give a quick thanks to our collaborators on the honey. It's Queen and Pollinate. These guys are amazing. Josh is amazing. This is a company that comes and help us maintain our hives here at Modern Herbal. Wanted to make sure that we were doing our own honey so we could make sure of the purity and make sure it was as super local as possible. And we are gonna be having that at the shop. And a lot of our formulas are made with this honey. I just kind of wanted to show you how easy it is not only to learn how to do some beekeeping, but also to have some beehives in your own yard. DIY, right? It is not hard. They're pretty docile. They kind of leave us alone. I leave them alone. It's a really nice relationship. But at the end of it, we get honey. It was super important to us, especially at Modern Herbal, to help the bees because they make the world go round, right? Like without the bees, we don't have anything. So come on, I'll show you some of the good stuff we got going on in the back. Come on. Like I'm legit as pumped as it could possibly be. I'm playing it extra cool. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> <laughs> and then as I crack the lid, the snake under the cover. That masks their alarm pheromones so they can't talk to each other. And so here I have a queen excluder. So the queen, she can't fit through those holes, but the worker bees can. So that way I can keep the queen down here. That This box, she's laying eggs. Then all of these they have available for storing nectar. A lot of times these end frames oh, won't have I any see. honey. Oh, here we go. Nice honey there. Ooh. Did you see that? You want to get the next one? Yes. So I use this just to pry them loose because they stick everything together right on the edges. Right just kind of put it right between there. Same thing on the other side. front of the hive and give it a swift shake. I had a slight moment of panic, but I'm back. <laughs> Very awesome, yeah. That's a nice one over there. It's heavy. Yeah, it's bad. I know, buddies. I'm sorry. That was a thrill. Keep working through. Okay. Brazilian pepper honey, it's kind of a, a yellowish tint to the wax there. Right. And then we're gonna go down this next box. You, you'll see that the, um, the wax capping is completely different, different type of honey. I can't wait to see what it tastes like. No, it's white. Yeah, you see how it's white. It's white. That's a nice amber honey there. Whoa. Yeah, I'm gonna let you shake it. Wait. Yep. <laughs> 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 what? I had no idea that my that there were this many bees. Why don't you keep going? Okay. Um, we'll do this one and this one. Okay. And I'm just gonna start walking these out through the box. Let's do this one here. Okay. Maybe, I, I want to get an even number. Maybe eight, I got six so far. I'll just do this one, we'll do six. Okay. I think we're gonna My father would have a party time. Like, this was life goals for me. Learning how to do this. I need this type of thing in my life every now and then. And not for 
for nothing, but the suit is kind of fly though, right? Like, look how it looks. Look how it looks with the mids, with the blazer mids. Yeah, it looks with the blazer mids, you know what I'm saying? You catch that? Can't take you nowhere. Super local honey. and I don't see any green. So we may be queenless. A lot of times they tend to go queenless this time of year. Why is that? I don't know. Um, sometimes they swarm and they just seems to have a harder time requeening okay. in the fall. But it is something that I need to, I need to know so that I can replace her if I, if I need to. Bring a queen with me next time I come here. How interesting though. No queen, no honey, right? Well, no queen, no more bees coming. Oh. And so these bees will start to die out and not be honey. Yes. Sometimes that queen accidentally gets stuck up in the honey supers. Mm -hmm. And that's what happened. Ah. So she got stuck up top. That's the brood there. Calf brood, there's some larva. And so what we're gonna do? You need to take one of those out. I believe she's in. in this box. I don't want to do the whole thing. Maybe this is me. We're gonna add that to the brood nest. Now, without the queen of cooler, she can go down and lay in both boxes. Once I put that bee escape on, I make sure there's no gaps like between the boxes. Right. Because once all the bees move out, other bees will tell. They can sense that this honey's unprotected. Try to rob it. Pulling honey off a bee yard this morning, and I had one hive that I didn't tape up good enough, and I went in, all the honey in two boxes were gone. Oh, no. The other bees had taken it. Isn't that crazy? Oh, wow. Wow. Look at this one. Yeah, look at, I mean, that thing. Is... Whoa. Pretty fat. It's heavy. Gosh. <laughs> That's awesome. Now, if all my hives were like this, it'd be ridiculous. Okay, so that was actually my first time harvesting honey. And um, it was thrilling. It was thrilling. It was thrilling. I loved it. Thank you so much, Josh, for teaching me. I can't wait for the next time. so excited. Okay, so this is the honey. I don't know if anybody's in here. Stratters. We pulled six frames. And now we're gonna go inside and put them in the instructor so we get to taste some honey. It's got a little bit of weight to it. Where's the good place to put this at, right? Anywhere you want. Right. Yeah, let's do it. All right, so your mom's a pro at this. She took the class. <laughs> so we've got a little bit of water on the bottom. You just wash it out. You want that with that paper towel. Get too much water in the honey because it'll ferment and then you have meat. It'll turn alcoholic if you get water content. Not too deep though, just try to scratch scratch them off the surface. See where those cap things are there? Only that part needs to be straight. Yeah, baby. Now if I could train all my kids to do this, my job would be easy. Yeah, you did good. Okay. <laughs> oh, get his hands. He got my finger. <laughs> now a little bit here, see those ones still have cappings? Yeah. Anywhere where there's cappings, if we don't scrape those off, the honey won't come out. Hey, yeah, you did good. Let's uh, clean that off. And we'll do the other side here. Alright, Gigi. Then see anywhere where that's white? That's what you want to scrape off. It's the white there. That's the top one. That's the top right, babe? It's tiny. You can lick it. <laughs> there you go. Oh, there's a lot there. Yep. 
That one looks good. Somebody want to grab another honeycomb? Think you can grab one out of there? The mother load. What are you doing? <laughs> and then we're also gonna have some beeswax so you guys could melt it down and make a candle or something like that. I'll take that. I'll do 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 that. You're gonna watch? Yes. Do you wanna help me? Yep. Put some in money. That's it on that side, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it actually, it spins out really nice. Those are not caps, so I try not to mess those ones Ooh, up yeah, too much. Yeah, you can use them again. Yeah. No, you have to watch them. Oh, we have a lot, We had these to get us more honey. <laughs> she does, in the back. Now we gotta spin it. You guys ready? Let's watch spin. Who's gonna spin it? Now, when you spin it, we don't want to put our hands in there, okay? So hands on the outside. All right, spin it as fast as you can. And as you spin it, if you look in there, see all that honey splinging out on the sides? You're making honey. Oh, whoa. It, as it spins, the honey comes out of the cells and comes against the walls and then it drains to the bottom. And then over there, let's make sure that honey gate's closed actually. So it's like, oh, whatever's left on this thing. Yeah. It's gets gone out. Yeah, it gets uh -oh. Yeah. Hey, you guys can. Yep. Gonna get those little fingers clipped. There you go. Okay, Gigi's turn. Gigi's spinning the other way. Oh, you got to do it. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.
Do you need honey for dinner? Yes. <laughs> Umi? Mm. Can I? I want to eat honey. You want to eat honey? Right well, now, let's, honey you want to taste some honey? honey? Okay, let's go right inside now, and honey, taste some honey. Sweet potatoes. Yay! We're going to have a honey inspired meal. Sometime you guys can hang out. I would love that. <laughs> yeah. Come on, you. 